Hello, my name is Ami Diamond. In this short episode, I'll show you uh, the new functionality of Add Shortcut to OneDrive. So, Add Shortcut to OneDrive actually creates a link on your OneDrive. Now, it's we actually um, want either to uh, form a document library uh, to take the whole link and put it to the OneDrive, either on the web or on the desktop, or it can be a folder, or it can be a shared uh, folder within OneDrive. So let's see how we do it. So I'm now um, on a team site. I'll create a document library. Let's call it a ABC. Let's add it. And now I will create a folder folder 1 and folder 2. If I click this add to OneDrive, you see it here, what it will do, it will create a shortcut in my OneDrive. So let's see first of all, um, if I click here, I can see my OneDrive and you see here um, a folder with a, a link here. So I'm now in my OneDrive and if I click on it, I'll see, I'll be referred to <coughs> the document library that uh, I did. Now, uh, the same thing, if I go to the synced OneDrive, you will see now um, under my OneDrive of my personal OneDrive, you see this link ABC and I see um, everything. Now, what happens if I want um, to remove it. So if I'm on the synced, I can right click and I can press remove shortcut. Okay. Second way is if I'm in OneDrive, I can, let me see where it is. Let's refresh. I can mark it and I can click the remove button See here. So that's that. Now, uh, the same thing actually I can do only on a folder, not on a document library. So let's see how, how we can do it. So I'll go to another library and let's say only folder two I want. So I can mark it. I can click here on the icon. I can also find it here. At to OneDrive and this uh, shortcut of folder 2 I will see first if I click here see folder 2 and I can click to it and I can also see it in my OneDrive sync let me see let me refresh and close again and this is my OneDrive let's see what it is here I don't see it, it might come uh, very soon. Um, okay, um, last thing is actually, if I'm in my OneDrive and I have a, a folder that was shared by, let's say, another user, you're sharing one, two, three, I can click on it and I can um, find the add to my, shortcut to my files. If I do this, I will see in my OneDrive, I will see, let's see, let's refresh. Here you see actually is the sharing one, two, three. So it's also from shared uh, folders in OneDrive and also from the SharePoint, it can be for the whole uh, library, it can be for a folder. Now let's just remove this. Um, I would like also actually to um, remind you not to use it that much because uh, there's many cases that this add to shortcut uh, causes problem of sync of document libraries. And what happens is actually um, that the sync stops working and uh, until Microsoft uh, solves this, uh, many people um, 
recommend not to use it even though it's it's quite good but this might be the reason that uh, sync document libraries stop working just to show you what I'm talking about so you see here there's a sync button if you click on it it will create a sync uh, document library uh, let's do an example I'll click here sync uh, in this case um, it's causing something else. Okay, so um, this is the add to sh shortcut to OneDrive. Please uh, use it carefully and uh, and enjoy. So hope you le learned something new. If you like it, subscribe to my channel and have a good day. Goodbye.